Uh, hello and welcome once again. Um, we're in season five now, um, which means, amongst other things, the fancy new Naxxramas card back. Uh, green and purple, that's lovely. And so, uh, today we are going to be ranking with um, a little bit of uh, Temple Warrior. We'll see how that gets us. We're starting at rank 15 and uh, 3 stars. Um, so yeah, as you can see from the deck list, we've got a uh, couple of Inner Rage, a couple of Execute, a couple of Whirlwinds, Fiery War Axes, a Manny Berserker, a Single Armor Smith, two Cruel Taskmasters, a Loot Hoarder, two Acolytes of Pain, two Harvest Golems, two Corcoran Elites, a Spellbreaker, yeah. double Arcanite Reaper, an Azure Drake, Low Theb, Stampeding Kodo, um, Double Argent Commander, Black Knight, and Gromash. So, ideally looking to get this over, I guess, by around turn 7 or 8. So we're going to have a Paladin. Uh, Lothab can probably go back, and I would probably rather draw into the Execute. So we'll keep the Armour Smith and the Fiery War Axe. And, uh, hmm. That's a nice draw. Because we can coin into a Manny Berserker, turn 1. Turn 2, Cruel Taskmaster on a Manny Berserker, and that leaves us with a 7-2 on turn 2. The light protects me. Which is just awkward. It means it, it has to be dealt with. <laughs> it's time for a little blood. Job's done. Yeah, that's your trick. Leaves turn three a little bit sketchy, but I guess we could load up the war axe on turn three. Uh -huh. What are you going to do? Let me think. That's a dire wolf. Okay. Very zoo looking so far. There we go. Ass Master up. And then gives us a 7 2. Which will run straight into your face. Uh, the downside, I suppose, with them having the uh, Argent Squire is it means to run the Argent Squire into the uh, into the 7 2 and kill that off and still retain the 2 1. Not on my watch. Oh, hello. Find shield on that as well. Interesting. Well, I don't know about you, but I've had just about enough of that diary of Alpha. Let's smash that in the face. Second fire war axe means we don't need to worry about being weaponless. My shield for Argus. Oh no, Defender of Argus. This is getting a little bit sketchy. Whirlwind, not quite what I was looking for. Armor Smith out, armor up, smash that. You have tea, tea helps everybody think. Thinking drink. So always remember T. Smart decisions made by T. Let me think. <sighs> That's a six, seven, and a three, three. This is not going according to plan. Not at all. Um, well, one. Excellent. And the fire works. Yeah. 
job's done. Well, I didn't envisage being on uh, on ten life in turn five. I most certainly did not. For the crusade. More defense shield. Draw into a boatload of nothing. Azure Drake you can use it, it draws a card, but it's kind of pointless at the moment. Gonna rage, gonna rage that, and it's a 3 2. Is a 3 2 any more use to me than a 1 3? I don't think so. Right in here, pop shield. So that's still no use. It looks like five damage coming my way, I have to say it. Strike. Right in there, armor off. At least that clears that uh and at least that would just a one. Great. An Arcanite Reaper is is of so little use to me just now. An Acolyte of Pain is right up there in terms of how little use that could be. Well, Gromash next turn, but... I really don't know how much his Gromash is going to be at the moment. 11, 7 on the board. Potentially holding up to the Silver Champion. So. GG. Well Nothing I can do with that. Nothing in hand. Nothing likely to be drawn. Knackered. Oh well, at least we got a golden charge. I'm looking for a very, very small silver charge. Uh. I think I may have got a bit greedy at the start with that one. I maybe shouldn't have just gone for the 7 2 and smashed it in the face. But... Live and learn. It's my instinctive aggroness. <laughs> See, I can do it again. I am going to do it again. Don't think that just because it screwed up once, I won't do it again. <laughs> it's so getting done again. There's something inherently beautiful about a 7 2 on turn 2. <laughs> What does this rogue have? Are you playing anything turn one? Do you have a turn one play? I'm assuming it's Miracle. Because... We never know if we have... Oh, okay. Okay. Going to Manny Berserker. And let's see how we go this time. Let's see how we go this time. I'm drawing the Black Knight, which is no use. What? Acolyte of Pain, no use. Harvest Golem. 
Gonna be the crew taskmaster. Haunted creeper. Back to work. I know, I know, but look at it. It's it's a thing of beauty. Seven two turn two. If that's not a thing of beauty, I don't know what is. Turn three harvest golem, I think. <laughs> Unless they play. Well, I don't think there's. Uh, the turn three is probably not a need for me to play. Nah, quite a pain. They've used an eviscerate though. That's good, that's it, out of their hand. Ignore this just now. And we can spellbreaker it next. Harvest Golem, there's no need for me to draw cards at the moment and I have nothing to activate it, no whirlwinds or anything like that, so... Harvest Golem's the play. If I had a whirlwind in hand, I'd be more inclined to attack that. If I don't, I could get rid of little spiders. But ah, yeti. Let me just think this through for a second before I go making any rash decisions. Um, four or five yet in the board, so if I park run into the Yeti... Because I want to keep board control. This deck is all about getting and maintaining board control, which means that Yeti has to go. It's not going anywhere with a Spellbreaker, that's only silencing our, our one twos, maybe stopping them a couple of points of damage. So... Park run in. Sack straight in there. Get the harvest ball in there as well. No problem. And then base. Job's uh. done. Okay. That seemed like a far better solution. Uh, turn five, we could just load up the Reaper. Or we could spell breaker this. I feel there may be uh, a gadget sound at some point in the near future from them. We must cleanse the sun well. Okay, so that's now two three. One two dagger up. Takes a two at the face there. Hmm. hmm. Let's look at the options. Armor up, one. Acolyte of Pain, useless here. Spellbreaker, silence, is a possibility. It leaves a 4 3 on. Uh, Arcanite Reaper, and then hit the Shattered Sun Cleric in the face is another. And Inner Rage to that, which leaves two. One one. The pleasure is mine. I could uh, no. could silence the the haunting creeper and then use the inner rage, but beating two cards for the sake of I must choose. okay, fortune for it. Get rid of that. And that's basically two one ones and a one one. That seemed like the best option. Oh, Assassin's Blade loaded up. And a deadly poison. Wow. Five four knife. Not bad at all. Don't see many of them kicking about. Harvest Golem on the draw. Utterly no use to me whatsoever, but never mind. Um, I quite the pain. Let's see if we can draw some answers. We're going to just ignore that and hit the face to keep some pressure on. 
effectively has a four charge Arcanite Reaper and I've no Acidic Swamp to deal with it. Or Harrison Jones, I would love the Harrison Jones. What have we got here, Ambush or 7 3? A 7 3 knife? Oh, we're, we're in big trouble. Big, big, big trouble. Again. Uh, nothing. There's nothing. Black Knight's useless. Bellbreaker's useless. It does nothing with Taunt. There's nothing at all. Bromash is not what I need right now. It's not. He's got seven damage sat there. I've got a potential six. GG. Well played. Oh, come on. Alright, one last game with this deck. We'll see how we go. Hmm, Priest. The light shall bring victory. Priest. So we've got an Acolyte of Cain, Gromash, and Corcoran. Hmm, Gromash away. Gotta go through all of them back. None of them are really helpful. Amani, Argent Commander, and Execute. Um, okay. Probably make a... There's my quirk run back. You can probably make a decent fist out of this. Job's done. Nothing for turn one. A Manny Berserker turn two. Hopefully we'll have drawn into something. Either a two or a three for turn three. And then quirk run five. Four mana. Yeah. Good work. I must consider... And there's the Eclat of Pain I threw away. Didn't hide them very well in my deck. <laughs> it's time for a little Job blow. Done. That mulligan was like, here. Any, any of these cards? No, no, I don't want them. Okay. How about these ones? We'll just set these other ones right on top of the deck here so you draw straight into them. Wow. Priest actually running Shadow Word Pain. How unique. Okay. Mind if I roll Job's done. Loot Hoarder. Little Loot Hoarder's fine. There's nothing else. Particularly dangerous. Corkron can go out next turn. Blade Master. Circle of Healing as well. Yep. Fairly. Predictable play. I go for a crown as well. I'll just go straight for the face because at the moment I don't, I didn't have the extra mana to use execute. So next turn, provided he doesn't, uh, provided he's going straight to the face with a four seven, then we'll. Oh no, he's trading in there. Oh, we'll execute him. Well, that doesn't really protect yourself from what I'm planning. Arcanite Reaper. No. No, I'd rather just get rid of that, I think. Is it worth playing the Acolyte of Pain? Uh, 
here, so. Hey, oh, I'm in there for a oh, cool taskmaster. That could be useful. Especially with the uh, ash in hand. Fine, so we got six mana. Hell of done. Well, the other execute would be lovely. Moral one. In a rage. What can we do here? Warwin makes it more... I could just lock up the Reaper. I can get this taunt out of the way. There's no way I can deal two taunt damage and what equip that. So. Or is the whirlwind in a rage? Ideally, I would have the Argent Commander. So I want to take five damage. I can't take five damage. I have to take full seven. Is it worth clearing Eladan off the board? And taking seven damage. Seven damage once over a potential nine from him and the two one that spawns. Yeah, worth getting rid of it. Leave the life totals about the same. The mana. mana addict. Oh, not a, right, I'm a particular fan of. Pay attention, because class. Tokens? Fine. You cast a man at it with no spells. Odd. Uh, okay. Armor Smith out. Back to work. Ask Master on the Armor Smith. Just some some armor. And what would we rather have? Plus this turn. Or summon a 1 1 apprentice. 3. Uh... Choices, choices. That only gains attack. So. I'll do 23 life is still pretty good for the moment. Plus, this is now a 3 3. And a 2-2 two, two on board. I can live for that. I do get a feeling that his Illidan just arrived in a pack and he felt he had the legend so he had to use it. Doesn't seem to fit. What else is in his deck? Firewood Shields, that's not 5-3. Well, there's a Kodo. Cool 4 6. Ouch. Nothing I have will deal with that for the moment, so. Archic Commander and Tower. Victory or death! Are we running here? Or here? 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 here. Meow, 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 meow. I'm running a card draw in a big way. I'd rather weaken that for the next turn. My eyes are open. Oh, come on. I'm not feeling good right now. Gromash and Farseer enraged ten times. I wonder. I 
What's that say? Does Lewis have help? Immediately. But I can't armor up. Buff someone and buffing anything else. Okay. Lewis have armor up. This is not looking good. An 8 mana cost Shadow of Death. Come on. Come the fuck on. Right, Gromash is going to act as a quick, quick destroy me if he's sitting on 10 at that. So. Gromash armor up. He will surely, surely throw things into Gromash because you don't want a 10 6 sitting on board. He absolutely has to throw something at Gromash. If he's got another Shadow of Death, I will cry on stream. I wonder. Go away. Screw you. Ah, three damage. Okay. Play with fire. In the light's name. They don't have two or less stack anymore because it's just uh, and that's not this turn, so that needs to be taken out. Let the pain speak to me. To Northrend, Victoria. Got to assume he's going to draw into a spell. Use that, and this will generate card draw from me. Thought steel. Card draw. Inner Rage is good, like that. So he's only got what I've got. Please tell me you have drawn absolute smash. What be the worst two cards? Loot Hoarder. Loot Hoarder and Armor Smith. Whirlwind, card draw. More card draw. Uh, more card draw. That worked out okay. I could deal with that. Uh, right, so. Could go Azure Drake. Let's go Azure Drake first. Hmm. That's a great program. That works for me. What else did you pilfer from me, you thieving little wench? You crap. Whatever you've got there, okay. Not playing it. What on earth could you have stolen from me that it's an execute? The only thing that makes any sense has to be an execute. I wonder. Board clear. Board clear, board clear. What have they got? Circle of Healer. 12 left in the deck. No sign of... You have to assume they've got an Ock and I. War axe. Armor. Eight. Set face as well, got it. In for a penny, in for a pound. Crack him in the chops. He's starting to get draw again though. If I used the energy, it would have only taken down two more. Thirteen, that doesn't make it. Hmm. We don't like you, priest. We do not like you. Blade Master. Holy Nova. Now they execute. It's the only thing that makes any sense that he could have got that he hasn't played yet is execute. Or the Black Knight. 
But if it's the Black Knight, I have no time. So he'll be waiting a while for that to go. Uh, is it worth doing anything with this Blade Master? What now? Four, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13. I can see 30 damage. First things first, armor up. There's not heals here, uh, but at this point, I think. Probably just try it first. <laughs> it's time for a little blood. Funny. Uh, One shooting the six damage. Unless he could have a whirlwind. He could have a whirlwind that he stole. None yeah, Black Knight makes sense. Um, to explain why you wouldn't play it before. Yes! Victory! We have done the priest. It took an awful lot longer than I had hoped. But we got there in the end. <laughs> so for this uh, for this recording we've managed to drop one star. Well... It could have been worse. Thanks for joining me. See you next time.